Hey viewers, this is my first redstone tutorial in Minecraft. What I'm going to be doing is a 2x3 sticky piston door. So, first step is your sticky pistons. You're going to put three up horizontally, just like that. Oops, sorry. And then you're going to do, you're going to leave one, two, three, four, and four spaces, and put your second row of, oops, Wow. Second row of three pistons. Second step is your blocks. You can use any kind of blocks. I like to use these wooden ones. I just think they look really nice. Alright, so you put one on each sticky piston. As you can see, this is where it's going to be closed. I'm going to take up those two. Alright, so this is where the redstone part comes in. <clears throat> First thing you do is you put a torch on the on ground level right there. This activates the first sticky piston, and then the second part you put a block here, which this the torch can power this block, which powers this piston. And then to activate the very top one, all you do is put put redstone on the top, and there it works. So now you do the same thing on the other side. So block on the middle, redstone on top, torch on the bottom. And there you have it, it is closed. So now you gotta put in some, make it so that it can actually open. So, where the lever is, you're gonna dig three deep, jump down, and then the second block under the um, torch, you're gonna take that out, and then put another torch on that block. As you can see, that inverts the power, so now it is open. Back right down here. And what you're going to do on the very edge, you're going to just need to dig up the top. Let's do the both thing on set. Do the same thing on both sides. So three deep, second block, torch in there. So what you're going to do is put a redstone right there, and then a torch right there. Again, yeah, now it is it is closed. So now you're going to put redstone all along here. Fly over to the other side. Put those blocks back. Took those out by mistake. So redstone, redstone, torch there. One redstone there. So now it is closed. So all you have to do here is put a pressure plate, two pressure plates, so one on each like part of the door. So now all you have to do is walk, and there you go. So now you want to be able to walk through the other side because you obviously can't. So all you have to do is two blocks, so one, two, on both sides, thick, three deep, and then on the second block right here, on one side. Dig all the way over. Connect it with redstone. Oops. And then you're gonna put a block, block there, and a block there, and then redstone there, and a redstone there. So that you can put in those redstone will activate the pressure plate. So then you want to block this off with some blocks, and then two more pressure plates here. Sorry, one sec, I'm going to put it to daytime. There. So here, walk, go through, it opens up. And then you can walk back over, and she opens up, closes automatically. So there you have it. It's a 2x3 sticky piston door. Um, this thing is also very easy to hide in a building. I'll show you over here. This is my um, sticky piston, or redstone house building, whatever you want to call it. My, obviously my entrance is my door. Very hidden. You can't see any of the well, any of the redstone. It's all walled off. Don't look over there, that's something else. <laughs> so there you have it. A two by three sticky piston door. It's starting to rain, so I guess it's time to go. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe.